Welcome back to our channel and thank you for tuning in and thank you for supporting us. But if you're new to this channel and you haven't subscribed yet, please encourage us by doing so, so that we can bring you the latest news as they come. And together, we shall support our great leader, Mazen Namdekano, IPOB, Eastern Security Network, to make our Biafran dream a reality. He said, The Fulani Sultan and Buhari Impostor panics and cries out as Nigerian soldiers resign en masse. They said that they are finished because they thought that they could deceive the soldiers to continue to help the Fulani Janjaweed massacre Biafrans. You know, mass resignation in the Nigerian military worries Buhari Posto and the Sultan, and the army chief panics as remnant soldiers are inexperienced Fulani terrorists and Boguaran terrorists re recruited through the Fulani Nigerian government's fake terrorist repentant program. According to reports, 18 Nigerian soldiers quit few days after more than 243 soldiers tendered resignation letters to the Army Chief, Lieutenant General Yahya Faru, over corruption, low morale, and others. You know, according to reports, some Nigerian soldiers serving in the 82 Division of the Nigerian Army have accused the garrison commander of the division, Brigadier General M.K. Ibrahim, a Fulani terrorist, of corruption and financial mismanagement. The Army General has been diverting 50% of their special assignment allowances for his personal use. But yet, they will tell them to come to Biafra land and they will start killing Biafrans. Whereas, they have not paid them their allowance, deceiving them. Brigadier General M.K. Ibrahim, a Fulani terrorist general, and the commander of the 82 Division Garrison has been extorting the Fulani controlled Nigerian soldiers their allowances by 50%. Those entitled to 50,000 Naira monthly now get 25,000 Naira. Some now get 15,000 Naira instead of 30,000 Naira. One of the affected soldiers lamented. You know, according to the aggrieved Nigerian soldiers, they said that their allowances is mostly cash and not usually paid into their accounts. While they are risking their life on special assignments, helping the Fulani Nigerian government, Massacre Biafrans. Somebody who is sitting comfortably in the barracks will still steal money meant for the soldiers. Definitely. The soldiers said their God will judge the Fulani general and commander and other extorting the Nigerian soldiers, another affected soldier said. You know, the accusation comes a few weeks after some personnel of the Nigerian army accused Buhari Posto of failing to check corruption and financial mismanagement among some top military officers while soldiers 
continues to cry on a daily basis. You know, this was what Mazen Abdekano was fighting for, to liberate them. But they refused to listen. Rather, they believed the lies and deception of the Fulani Nigerian government. And they were killing Biafrans. Yet, their salaries are not paid because they are Fulani Janjaweed slaves. Whereas their counterparts, who are Fulani Janjaweed, have all been paid. Even the repentant Boko Haram have been paid. You know, the soldiers, in an open letter to Buhari, imposter, accused top army officers of corruption and extortion. They said, despite the numerous complaints, nobody is saying anything about the unpaid allowances by the military finance corps. They won't pay. They're only deceiving them. And that was what Asu found out. But they found out very late. That for over five years, Buhari Impostor's regime have been deceiving Asu. They have been deceiving everyone. They are all liars and criminals. You know, the Nigerian soldiers have complained severally how they have been giving 20% of their 100% allowance, which was signed into law by Buhari Imposto in 2017, which is known as MAFA. No one is saying anything, and Buhari Imposto is not interested to follow up or investigate the matter. Because he's being deceptive and he's only using them to decimate his perceived oppositions and Biafrans. They should all leave Biafra land and resign from Nigerian military. In fact, Buhari Imposto has destroyed the Nigerian military. And that is why it is very important for Biafrans to support Biafran restoration struggle and fight. Because that is the only place, that is Biafra is the only land where we be our friends can actualize our God-given freedom and potentials and growth and fruitfulness. Nigeria is a fraudulent contraption, a false marriage that Chuko Kikabiyama has placed a cost on. After the Fulani Janjaweed, in collaboration with their masters, the United Kingdom and other international community military, committed a great crime against the people of Biafra, where they extrajudicially murdered over 5 million Biafrans in cold blood. My brothers and my sisters, the Fulani Janjaweed must pay for all the atrocities against Biafrans. Chuko Kikabiyama neither sleeps nor slumbers. He is a man of war. He will fight our battle he did it for the children of Israel. He will do it for the children of Biafra. He will do it for us. No matter what the full Anijanjaweed does, 
Biafra must be restored. In this their lifetime, they will see it. They will see that Biafra will be restored. Thank you, my brothers and my sisters, for watching this video. And bye-bye for now.